Hello! Welcome <laughs> to this tutorial. <laughs> Hello, welcome to this video. Um, I just got this print from Latter Day Home. It's Jesus and Love Everybody by J. Kirk Richards. And then I went to Target, grabbed this frame, and Jeff was moderately bummed because it had saute holders, and apparently those are the worst hangs. So I thought I would show you guys how to hang it. More like Jeff's gonna show you. <laughs> I'm gonna fail. The tools we'll be using in this tutorial is a cordless drill, a laser level, a tape measure, drill bits, and some drywall anchors and screws. Okay, so first thing we want to need to do is to measure the distance between the middle crevice of each of the sawtooths. And so just grab the tape measure, uh, put my little metal thing right there in the middle, line it up. It looks to be about eight inches and one eighth. Now arguably the most important step is Make sure you're hanging it in the place you want it. So uh, let's ask the boss later. What do you think about right there? Maybe a little lower. A little lower? Yeah. And a little more. And a little more. Your eye level is different than mine because you're very tall. I'm just going to make a little mark. I'm going to drop the picture down about a quarter of an inch to make the mark. All right, <clears throat> so we found how high we want the picture to be. Now we want to find um, the middle point on this wall. So we're just going to take our tape measure and we are going to find the halfway point. And it's about 10 and a half and just make a mark. Now the real secret to getting perfectly level is a laser level. This will make your life way easier. I picked this one up from Home Depot, maybe Lowe's. Uh, I'm pretty sure you can probably get one on Amazon. But it's pretty cool. The really nice thing about this laser level is it will suction come on the wall. And so I'm now hands free to hang the picture. When we measured the distance between our saw teeth, it was eight and one eighth inch. And so what we're actually gonna do is Take half of that, which is 4 and 1 16th, and measure that out from the center point. Okay, so we have our two marks for where we want the anchors to be. So we will just make sure that we are Alright, with the hardest part done, we just need to put our drywall anchors in. These just just push them in. Stud. Basically, we hit a piece of wood in the wall. And with the stud, we can just drill straight into it. We'll just put our other one. That's the moment of truth. What do you think, boss? I love it. Perfectly level. What the record state, I don't love that he calls me boss, but I do love this picture. 